guys, uh, my name is Jasmine and I'm finally back in here. I am so excited. I have a new camera and I'm back to the blogging mood. And you know that I love traveling. I also love modeling. So I'm gonna be combining those two elements and I'm gonna be showing you guys in my newest blogs more about traveling. I'm gonna be traveling to some hotels in central florida and also southern florida and i'm going to be giving you my honest review about all these places so make sure you subscribe and connect with me and all my adventures so now i'm all ready to go to orlando so let's go So very important. So everything inside there must be clean. All right, I just got to the room and as much as I love this place because I've been coming here for a long time now, I have to say the media, you have to step it up on the um, check-in process because it's so slow. It's so slow. Let me tell you what I love about this place. This place is huge and you get a lot for your money and on top of that you're super close to the Disney parks. This is a two bedroom suite with two bedrooms and two bathrooms and a full kitchen and I only paid $114 per night plus taxes and the resort fees. Let me show you around. Here's the entrance and the full kitchen. You have a stove, a full microwave, and um, a big fridge where you can bring and storage all your food. Let's move on to the dining space where we have a dining table. Aquí tenemos una mesa para comer, so sigamos para el próximo cuarto. So here's the living room where we have a nice big couch that converts into a bed, and we also have a flat screen TV, maybe a 40 inch to watch some TV later on. As you can see, this is a very spacious um, master bedroom. We have a really nice big bed, a proof that is super comfortable by me. And then we have a desk for the computer or any work and um, a little chair, another TV, and then we have a nice big bathroom on the other side. So look at the size of this master bathroom. It's Big, super nice, super clean with a tub, a shower, and let's move on into the next bedroom. Second bedroom is a little bit smaller than the master bedroom, but it's still super big as you can see. Um, the only thing that you don't have here is a desktop, but it's very functional and very comfortable. Let's go into the bathroom. Second bathroom is super spacious too and very nice and very clean. All right, now it's time to relax after such a long drive and then to go on for two free drinks. I just changed into my PJs. I'm way too tired, so I just sent my husband down to go get the free drinks and we're gonna order food from the restaurant here. That's one of the main things that I love about this place that they have a great restaurant with great food. So I'm gonna call it a night and tomorrow I'm gonna show you um, the pool area and the rest. 
Good morning, good morning, buenos dias. I got all ready to get a nice shower. I went to sleep really early last night because I was beat, but now I'm ready to conquer the day. And I had in mind to do a photo shoot early this morning, but I forgot to pack my stuff. So now I'm gonna go downstairs to show you as I promised. So as you can see here, they have a really great pool area. Um, I love coming here. The pool is heated and it's always super clean. Um, they also have a great outdoor dining right there, which um, you can order lunch, breakfast, um, snacks, dinner, and um, their food is really delicious too. They also have now um, a new sushi place. I'm gonna show you, this is the, um, totally new but and I haven't tried it out so next time we come back here um, I'll show you I'll, I'll give you my review on it honest review about the Melia in Orlando. The Melia is located in Celebration only like about six miles away from all the Disney parks so it's very very convenient um, if you want to stay close if you come here with your family. Um, this place is super clean. I highly recommend it especially if you come here with your family. Um, Yes, it's not a luxurious place like most of the Disney properties, but let's be honest. If you go to one of the Disney properties and you stay there, you are going to probably spend no less than $400 plus all the fees and the taxes. That's like probably the minimum you can spend there. And here, for as you can see, for a whole suite with two bedrooms, two bedrooms, a full kitchen, you only I, we only spend $114 plus the uh, taxes and the resort fees, so it's not bad at all. I highly recommend it. Um, the the people that work here are amazing, very polite, uh, and they work really hard to. Uh, give us a great experience. So if you are in the lookout for a good place to stay in the Orlando area close to the parks, this is the place you should check out. I'm gonna leave the link um, in the description below so you can check it out and if you have any questions you feel free to comment and I'll be answering your messages. Pack it now to head over to Disney Springs to have lunch and then back home. <laughs> All right, so if I find something interesting in Disney Springs, I'll share it with you. If not, I'll catch you the next time. Don't forget to subscribe and comment. Bye. Adios.